Hello um, and welcome to the first video in a playlist on percentages. What we're looking at here is increasing £30 by 17.5%. In this playlist um, we're not going to be using a calculator, we're going to be doing these things um, without a calculator. So first of all increase £30 by 17.5%. Um, the first thing that I'm going to do here is I'm going to find out what 10% of my amount is. So 10% of my amount, my amount is £30. To find 10%, I simply have to divide um, my amount by 10. So that gives me £3. Now what I'm doing here is I'm finding easy percentages to find and using those as building blocks to get to a percentage that on its own might be quite difficult to find. Um, so I've got my 10%. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to find 5%. Um, so 5% again a nice easy percentage to find because that's just going to be half of what 10% is. So 10% here is £3, half of that will be £1.50. Um, now the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to again I'm just going to half it, I'm going to find out what 2.5% is. So half of 5% is 2.5%, half of £1.50 is going to give me 75p. Now by working out these building blocks, what I could say is that here, if I added all of these together, what I'll have is I've got 17.5%. Um, so seven, my 17.5% 17 here is simply going to be these numbers added together. So I've got £3 plus £1.50, which gives me £4.50. Add on my 75p, and so that gives me in total £5. Oh, don't know what happened there. Um, five pounds and twenty-five p. Um, now I'm not quite finished here because it's asking me to increase my amount by seventeen and a half percent. I've just worked out seventeen and a half percent is five pounds twenty-five. So increase thirty pounds by five pounds twenty-five. My final answer here is going to be thirty-five pounds and twenty-five. So just adding on that percentage to my original amount. And that there is my final answer. Um, here, uh, next question, I'm being asked to decrease £40 by 57%. Uh, first of all, I'm going to work out what 50% is. Um, so we don't always have to work out what 10% is. There might be a quicker way to do it. And it's all about finding an easy percentage to calculate. 10% is easy to calculate because you just divide by 10. 50% is also a nice one to calculate because that's just half of your amount. So half of my amount here is um, would be £20. So half of 40 gives me 20. Then um, what I'll do next is I think I'll find 5%. 5% uh, here, well that's just going to be one tenth of what 50% was because 5% is one tenth of what 50% is. So to find out what my 5% is, I'll simply divide £20 by 10 that will give me my 5% and so my 5% here is 2. Now um, next up I'm going to work out what my 1% is. Now if 5% gives me £2, 1% well that's going to be um, just £2 divided by 5. 5% um, to get to 1% I would just divide 5% by 5 and so here I'm just going to do exactly the same and so £2 divided by 5 would give me 40p. Got a bit weird again. Um, again here, um, I'm not quite finished yet. I've got 55 and another one. That gives me 56. I actually need 57, so I'm just going to take another 1%. Now this leaves me with my 57% and so my 57% will be 20 plus 2 plus, eight, uh, plus 40 plus 40 so my um, my 57% gives me uh, uh, £22.80 now all that I'm going to do next is it's telling me to decrease £40 by this 57% and so my answer is going to be £40 minus the amount that I've just worked out here. So £40 minus £22.80 
I can say that my final answer is going to be um, 17 pounds and 20p. And that there, just putting that in a the box, is my final answer.